Hello everyone and welcome back to the channel. In this video, I did a last minute race at the Nordschleife in the Porsche Cup. Now having done this lots before, I figured I'd be fine. I know the circuit, I know the car. Now that's where I'd be wrong. The thing I didn't know when I signed up for this race, five minutes before it started, was that it had rained and the circuit was wet. So prepare to witness three laps of me on the brink of dying. Anyways, I really hope you enjoy the video. And if you do, make sure to leave a like and press that subscribe button. This will be a standing start. Be ready to watch for the lights. Go! Right side. Still there. Still there. Clear right. Car right. Clear right. Okay, Aaron. The next car is Nikolai. Car number one. I do not remember how to break in this car. Two positions. Don't know how. Oh, I can't get this car to turn. <laughs> Something tells me the guy in front of me is just going to disappear. Got no problems whatsoever. He's just going to fly off into the distance. At least we have the wet weather to blame when things do go wrong. Although it is literally just a slightly damp track and that's it. Need to be really careful through food plats. Just patience and then get on the power and look at the run we get. Just through being patient in the first stage. Now I could try something here, but I won't. Because I fancy being alive. Good defensive line from him. It's a good job he went there because I don't think I was. Oh, I think I was going to kill him if I stayed behind him. Into the foxhole. I'm going to lift. Because there's, yeah, big puddle there. You saw how he almost just went straight into the wall. Velcro on my bloody glove keeps coming off. That's so annoying. Down to fourth. Tip it in. There's like barely any grip. Oh, it's so easy to lock up there. That's exactly where I locked up in practice. We got a rapid exit out of the uh, hairpin. Through the slowest corner on the circuit. All the way down to first for that corner. Nice exit out of it. Again, I'm not really too fussed about 
making an overtake happen because we're both just going to make silly mistakes just like that. See, I didn't have to do anything. And now we lead. But in all honesty, I think holding this lead might be a little bit tricky. Careful on the power there, the rear started spinning up a tiny bit. Don't need my wiper anymore because I'm not in a spray, that's nice. Now I don't know how the how bad the puddles are through this quick section. But I hope that our downforce sort of saves us. I think it should be fairly dry. Through the fast left hander, I'm gonna be really careful. No break, drop it to fifth. Oh my lord. That's why you need to be careful. Left side. Left. Did not have that, that was close. Breaking into the carousel now. Carry as much speed as we can. Decent exit. We didn't have the best entrance, so our speed could have been better. Oh, the grip is so all over the place. This is why you practice before you race. <laughs> There's nothing there. My line is just... Woo, I'm everywhere. Wow, yeah, me and him both did the exact same thing. No grip on the outside. And again, there's nothing there. I can't even see these puddles. Oh, that is not the line. Oh wow, every now and then through the fast sections the steering just goes completely light and it's so scary. As you go from like, oh yeah I know what I'm doing, I'm confident, to suddenly just not feeling what the car's doing anymore. Into the Kleiner carousel, barely even got it in there. Oh no, the green car loses it, taps his nose on the inside, we'll take that into the final corner for the straight get on the power oh lord there's no grip oh. and there we are a two second lead now coming down the dotting huh? if we keep it clean we can keep this but that's a big ask, there's still two more laps. We just have to do what we can. I'm gonna start lifting already. I don't fancy bidding it at like 160 miles an hour. Ooh, no grip. Just about. Bloody hell. On to the GP circuit. Here we go on to our second lap now. This is definitely stupidly scary. Alright, again into T1. Breaking nice and early. Not hard enough though, that's for sure. Bloody hell. 
on the second turn. There's just, there's just, I'm getting nothing out of the car. Spinning up the rears. A little bit of a drift. Down to second, tip it in. God, I really have forgotten how to drive this thing. I'm definitely trail braking nowhere near enough. It doesn't help, but I've driven the MX-5 for a week. The MX-5 is entirely different in all ways. This car doesn't steer. The MX-5 doesn't do anything other than steer. You spend your entire lap in the MX-5 completely sideways. Down to second. Get it tipped in. Patient, patient, patient. On the power. Use the right side to open it up. This green car knows this part of the track very well. I mean, I'd like to say I do too, but I'm... <laughs> I just don't know what I'm doing right now. Turn car, come on. I will also add that the big setup in this car is horrendous here. I don't think it knows uh, that it's meant to be driven at the Nordschleifer. I think whoever set it up just sort of chucked a few things out of the car and said, yeah, that'll probably do it. But it just feels like I'm driving a paving slab. Bloody hell, that's so scary. It grips literally at the very last second when you think you're about to eat the wall. That is absolutely terrifying. So bad. And second, first, even. Just give me some sort of rotation. No, that's not the line. Down to third, miss, hit, miss. We did that correct, although it wasn't very fast. Second for the slowest corner, down to first. Green car kind of flies up the inside. Don't think he really wanted to do that. Spinning up the rears again. I forget what this corner is called. But it's just above a little, I think. Fun fact. And towards louder bend. Hopefully we don't end up like him. If I remember correctly, uh, his accident was a cause of the rain. So let's just not copy. Green car might have got a good run out of there compared to us, we'll see. I'm not sure if he's in tow distance though. I think he is. We'll watch that delta very closely. Yeah, that's two attempts he's gained. Right, I really need to not die this time. With this turn. It doesn't turn. 
That's so scary. Getting a little bit loose there. My experience in the MX-5 <laughs> taught me how to catch it. I'm joking, I already knew how to catch a car, but still. It definitely can be applied. I think you spend more time in the MX-5 trying to not die than you do focusing on driving. Right, shift down, get it tipped in early. Okay, I was on the power way too early there. It was just no grip again. Turned in too early there. Now we're running to the outside. This is horrendous. Oh, and I've cocked up my line here again. Although we've sort of recovered it. Nice. Down to third. Hill helps us break a little bit there. And keep it on the inside. Bring it around. Down here, don't run too wide on the exit. Don't run off track. I'm just getting no rotation. Oh, bollocks! There's nothing! <laughs> Every time I put a gap on this green car, I have some sort of lockup. Right, over the jump, break a little bit before, into fourth. No grip, no grip, no grip. Bloody hell. These are only very light, wet conditions as well. This isn't like torrential rain. Obviously, I'm not very experienced and I'm... I'm severely underprepared. Because normally in this car, when I used to drive it more often, I would dominate this circuit. I was very fast. Not the fastest, but I was a very confident driver. Right now, I am scared. Every single time I'm about to press the brake pedal, I think to myself, are these my final moments? Patient, and then on power. Uh, still running wide. He's gonna be in the tow, I think. Oh no, we're pulling away. That's two tenths gained already. We got a really good exit compared to him. I'll be interested to see what sort of lap time this is going to be. Under the Bilstein Bridge we go. Shout out Jimmy Broadbent. And Steve and Misha, can't forget them. I've actually been quite enjoying Steve's old karting content and all that from uh, sort of early days of Quadrant recently. So shout out Steve, he's a GOAT. And obviously Misha, because this is his circuit. That is legally, he owns it. Break car, break! Come on! Oh, massive switch back from the green car. Still there. I had nothing there. Hold your line. I have to go down the inside now. Hold your line. Clear left. Super deep again. Not Hold ideal. Right. Switch back yet again. Hold your line. Hold your line. Hold your line. Right. Fairly clean racing there. We had a tiny bit of contact. Nothing too serious though. This guy's got a really good grip on the GP circuit. God, I could be doing this so much quicker. Oh, getting loose again. Down the second. Get it turned in. Come on, car. Through the first turn, Sabine Schmidt's curve. 
He ate a bit much of the uh, curb there, so that's not helped him. Down two gears, get it slowed. Into second, just because I'm desperate for some bloody grip. <laughs> There's probably some like Nordschleife rain masters right now watching this, thinking, what is this idiot doing? I'm sorry guys, I haven't driven this car for a while. Alright, again, three flip flats. Just need to be as safe as possible. Yep, not too bad. Carried some decent speed there, although he's actually done better than me. Maybe a little slow on entry, but his, his exit's pretty decent. Going towards, what is this, Bravery Bend, or is that the other one? I don't know, I forget. He's a lot braver than me, good to know. Turn in, car, please. Right. Lift off down here, because I don't want to get turned into an Armco sandwich. He looks down the inside, although I don't reckon that was on purpose. I'm just using first to give me some talk out of that corner because I did it rubbish. Down one gear. Get it turned in. Yep. This is the corner where it's really easy to lock up. Yep, there's the lock up. And again, it's pretty easy here. Into first, get a bit more acceleration. Come on, I just can't get it to turn. Miss hit miss, yeah again, not too bad. And just in case, oh no! Oh. No, 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 no. Okay, we're right on his bumper. Shite, stay close. You might get it back. I agree, Jim. Shite indeed. Come on. Before I lost it, I was going to say, just in case you didn't know, this is the slowest corner on the circuit. <laughs> Or did I mention that already by any chance? I'm going to second here. Oh. No! Try getting a good entrance to carry some speed, but couldn't quite do it, and he managed to recover his rubbish entry. I think we're just about in the toe, but definitely quite far off. And I know that he's better through the left-hander coming up. Okay. We survived it. Doesn't feel like the most elegant corner in the world. In these conditions. Run. Deep to the outside, turn it in. On power. Sending it towards the carousel. Brake. Throw it in. Oh, almost send myself straight out the top of it. Right, we're on his bumper now, let's not kill him. I would have loved to go down the inside there, but I couldn't quite set it up. Oh, no. He's done really well through there, carried lots of speed.
Oh, come on, car. We can't be locking up. We'll take the off track. All in the name of competitive racing. Come on. All right. Another lock up, like always. Use the curb that we don't need to use. Getting a bit light over the crest. I'm coming towards the jump. Brick the four, down to fourth. No grip, no grip. Bollocks. No, I'm still chasing you. I'm still chasing you, Nicola. Come here. <laughs> We're definitely um, running out of chances here. We'll be quite lucky to get a win now. Best we can do is hope for a mistake on his part, not ours, obviously. Come on. If I can get in the toe, then it's possible. Oh, come on, there's no grip. Into third. Right, a good exit here is crucial. Mm. Could have been better, but are we quicker? We've gained a tenth. We're not quite in the toe, though. That's just us getting a quicker exit. That's another tenth. Nine tenths off him. If we could get this, this would be ridiculous. We're closing. We're not going to be passing by the end of the straight, but you never know. We might be able to make something happen here. Only five tenths off now. Now, I don't want to die, so I'm taking this easy. No! Where's my braking? Ah! Oh. Just like that. There goes my chance. Well, there it is. P2. That's better than I was expecting. I thought we were going to die. That was some good racing with the green car. I can't even say thank you to him. He left already. <laughs> good thing about that result is we lost because of our own mistakes. It was nothing to do with foul play or anything like that, which I've encountered just a little bit. Why are you doing that? Okay. What a race. That was really good fun. And really, really exhausting and very scary. Wow.